everybody and welcome into another video. It is Dream Snaps Day. The shop is refreshing. Let's go see what I got on my Dream Snap for the last time. The theme last time was a day at Disney and here's a reminder of what I did. I really like it and I hope that it does well. I hope I at least get 4,000 Moonstones, but let's go check it out. Here we go. Let's see what I got. <gasps> Yay, I did. I got 4,000. Okay, I scored 64 and I ranked 3,000. 200 so I got my 4,000 moonstone so I can buy stuff in the shop let's go check out the shop I actually don't know what's in there yet okay let's see what is in the shop Ooh, a royal jacket set let's take a look at this it is a set a long jacket with gilded roses and a belted jacket with gilded roses okay this is actually really pretty I've never bought any of the clothing in the premium shop but look at this. This is actually really nice. And since I just got the 4,000, is this like a skirt? What is this? This is literally like a little skirt. I, I, I have to, I have to buy this. We're ordering it. Okay. I got the long jacket and then the belt jacket. Let's try it on. Let's go back and look. Actually, I already have the nightmare castle. I could show you guys that. So you see what it looks like. I never really noticed that the top of it is floating like that. Uh, we'll have to go look at it. I never noticed that before. I still don't have this set, the whimsical pets. I think they're really cute. They kind of leave a little trail of, I don't know, mist or something behind them when they walk. I just, I still haven't decided if I want to get that. I think these came out when I didn't have enough moonstones. I did buy this enchanted fountain, so I can show you guys that too. First, let's try out the long jacket with the gilded roses. Wow, that's actually really pretty. Uh, I like this a lot. I like these black pants. We maybe can change the shoes real quick and try and find shoes that match. I don't know if I have any that would really go. Oh, these fancy black and gold boots actually look pretty good with it. Uh, so this is a nice little outfit. It's super fancy. I love the back. Now let's try the belted jacket. Oh wow, this is really cute, the belted jacket. And I think I have pants on right now, so if I take the pants off, what does that look like? Whoa, <laughs> you could have, I think it's just meant to be a jacket, not necessarily a skirt, because that's a, that's a little bit of a short skirt, but maybe we could put some shorts on underneath it. Where are the shorts at? If we put the black shorts on, I mean, at least I feel better about there being shorts underneath it, but it kind of looks cute. Yeah, she's got shorts on, so it's okay. We're okay. Uh, but yeah, I think it's meant to just be a jacket, but man, it could technically kind of look like a little dress. Maybe if we add some socks to it. Okay, some little knee socks. We're getting a little risky here. Let's try shoes. I don't know if these shoes, if I'm loving them, but I don't have that many options. I have black shoes and then buttoned, the buttoned shoes, but then yeah, probably take the socks off. Okay, but if we do put pants with it, you saw it looked really good with the black skinny jean underneath it. That's probably something more I would wear in real life, but it's cute. I really like the back. These boots go really nicely. Let's get off the grass. Yeah, these boots look really nice. I think this is a nice set. I haven't bought any of the clothing, like I said, but this is not bad. Let's go check out the fountain. This is the fountain. It's really pretty. It doesn't move. It has has basically frozen water in it and then if you want to see what it looks like at night it kind of looks the same see but there's no lights on it or anything so no lights nothing like that but it does have a little bit of a shine and it's a very pretty fountain kind of uh larger and i don't mind it i like it a lot uh i obviously i bought it before and i liked it so there is the fountain and now let's go check out the house here is the house. I have it up here in Forgotten Lands. The top does float. I actually never noticed that. <laughs> I didn't realize that the middle top floated, but it's a nice little house. It's kind of hard to get over here. I have a bunch of stuff uh, kind of in the way for you to be even be able to see it. <laughs> but you can see that it lights up and let's move it over here so you can maybe see, oh my gosh, I can't move it anywhere because everything is just a mess. 
Night thorns are taking over everywhere. Look at the pumpkin. I didn't realize that glowed like that. This is Jack Skeleton's tree. I just never realized that it had that glow to it at night. That's really cool. Okay, let's put it right here so that we can get a better view. Putting it right here, you can see, there it is. It's very nice. It looks really good in this area. And then if you go inside of it, it looks like this and then you can decorate it to make it however you want so it's not really like an extension of your own home but it is a nice little house and then changing it to daytime i'm trying to get better showing you guys daytime and nighttime because things look different different times of day but there you go it is a very nice house pretty stained glass the top does float and that's very cool i never noticed that until now let me go around this back side so you guys can see the back it's just pretty flat on the back just like that but it looks really nice up here I think that I'm going to go ahead and buy those companions because I've got a lot of moonstones oh my gosh I have a lot so we're just going to buy them I didn't buy them before because I didn't have enough but now that I do let's see what they look like they're super cute here is the little squirrel where is he he's down there you see how they kind of have like I don't know mist coming off of them maybe we should go somewhere else so you can see them better the grass up here is so long here you go you can see him he's kind of like i don't know kind of like a little ghost squirrel i like how it turns blue like how the pink stuff turns blue that's kind of cute let's take a picture with him so you can see that there he is he's adorable i don't know he's kind of like a little ghost squirrel here's the little alligator he's pretty much the same they just are different companions but there you can see him he's pretty cute too just got that little bit of a mist coming off of him here's the raven which might be my favorite because that mist kind of like I don't know it just it looks really cool when they fly around I like it but this is what it looks like when you're taking a picture with him look at him he's pretty neat I, I think I like the raven the best more than the squirrel and more than the alligator but let's check out the last one the last one is the whimsical raccoon so we're gonna get him on our shoulder and he's pretty cool these would have been great uh, for Halloween dream snaps or something, but I like them. They're not bad. Uh, now that I had enough moonstones, I don't think they're horrible to buy if you have enough moonstones to get them. They're kind of cool. And then so you guys can see what they look like at night. They're very bright. They glow. Uh, they're kind of neat. I like them at night a lot because they just they're just very glowy and cute. The next challenge that we have is winter's here. It is an outfit challenge. So time to bundle up and share your warmest winter fashions. Mandatory is strong and familiar. Suggested is simple and playful. And they've got a nice little scene in the Frosted Heights up here with some snowmen. So this is kind of cute. I do have a winter plaza going right now. So I could technically take a picture up here or I could probably do a build over in Frosted Heights. My Frosted Heights is in desperate need of stuff. <laughs> like this side of it is just awful. I did put Eve up here. Maybe I could incorporate that into my dream snap. And then on this side, I have the castle that has the fireworks. And then obviously Anna's house. I also have this cute little area with skates and skating so i'll figure out a place to do the dream snap probably up here i think and make it look cute and wintry but let's do some voting really quick to end out the video how did you do in your dream snaps i'd love to know this one is going to be the out of the toy box dream snap which is pretty fun i'll show you my submission real quick right here i really had more fun than i thought i would with this one i didn't think i'd like it but after i did it i absolutely loved it and this was a decor challenge so we're kind of looking at their decorations around them but this is i like her outfit on this one with the cute hat and everything uh i think we're gonna see a lot of pizza planet i'm gonna go with the left yeah we're gonna see a lot of pizza planet look there's pizza planet there it is i tried to incorporate it in my 
mind, but then at the last minute, it didn't really go very well. So I did the area around my Pizza Planet instead. This is really cute. I like how she put the wings on with her Buzz Lightyear costume. She's got Pizza Planet and everything in the back. And then this one, Pizza Planet. I swear we're going to see it in every single Dream Snap, but I'm not mad about it. It's a pretty cool item. Wow, look at this one. I actually really like this indoor. I wonder how many indoor submissions we're gonna see. This is really, really nice. I have these couches in mine, but they're outside, but I really like how it looks inside. So I'm gonna go with the left. Looking over these two, I love the little aliens and the Buzz Lightyear thing is so cute. And then she's got Woody. I'm gonna go with the right. Look at this chair. I don't have this chair right here. I don't think I've ever gotten this little half. It's like a teacup but that's really cute. I don't have that chair at all. And I also don't have this alien thing with all the aliens inside. So, and I've been playing since the beginning of the game, but it's crazy how you still don't have items. So I'm gonna go right on that one. Let's look here. Oh, she put on the cardboard outfit and the chair again, but look at the right. Oh my goodness. These are both really good. I like her little outfit in the chair, but there's something about the lighting in this one, the way that the light is coming through the window and then she's sitting there with her little robot. This one is just, I don't know, this one is really well composed. So I'm gonna go with the right. Between these two, I really like the right one, I think. I think there's a little too much empty space in this one. Man, she's got that chair too. I need that chair, uh, but I'm gonna go right. Let's see between these two. So I think these players maybe didn't have a ton of items, which is such a bummer because my daughter got this game for Christmas and she didn't have any Toy Story items, so she couldn't do the Dream Snap at all. Uh, so that was a bummer, but it looks like maybe these two players didn't have everything either. So I think I'm going to go right. Okay, between these two, she's got the floor and the aliens, but this one, she's got the chair, the little popcorn machine. That's adorable. I'm going to go right. And then on the left, she went Buzz Lightyear. And then this one is cute, but I'm going to go left, I think. I like how she kept the helmet off and just did the top with these pants, even though it's not an outfit challenge. But you can see she used the same furniture and everything, so I'm going to go left. And then this will be our last one. So we can either do this one here. She used the frame. She's got these cute little plants on her table. Two of those chairs that are so cute. And then this one over here is just really nice. Uh, you can see some of the rides and stuff in the background. It's kind of a hard choice. I think I'm gonna go left. I just like how bright this one is and the way it's composed. Okay guys, thank you for hanging out with me today. Let me know what you got on your dream snaps. Do you like this outfit? in the shop I really actually do I like this a lot uh, I might have to change my hair I don't know if it matches but this is my favorite hair so I might just keep my hair but let me know what you think in the comments below and I will see you guys next time okay bye